Hi, if you are new here, I'm Kaniti, and if you're already watching this channel, welcome back. Today we got a Patreon request for the anime Durarara. <laughs> I'm not sure if I pronounced this right, but this month we are going to watch first free episode. It's a completely blind reaction. I don't know anything about this anime, so let's see how it pans out going into the first episode. So let's get to it. Let's go. Looks like we are starting from the opening. A betrayed sunset. Oh. Take a turn, fairy. Okay, I like the song. No way I'm going to remember all the names just from the opening. <laughs> But it looks cool. There are a lot of characters. <laughs> Holy shit. Hmm. Uniforms. If it's going to be something like Slice of Life, I will be so happy. <laughs> One of my favorite genres. Okay. So there are some like school students and some I think older characters also as well. Mysterious, okay. I liked how it moved, showing how fast he's going, very cool. So, this is the same guy who mm. Obviously, I didn't remember anyone, like, just from the opening. So, I don't, I can't remember, like, is he the one we see on the motorcycle? Fifteen. God. Mm hmm So our character starts at a new school. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, it's good he decided to take the leap. Is that his friend? I like his style. Um... <laughs> A vibe choice. Mm. Yeah, he seems funny. And his design is really cute.
pack seems pretty mild. Well, it depends. It looks pretty dark. <laughs> Don't they... St they, I mean, they start at spring, right? The new year um, uh, in school. Might still be uh, getting dark pretty early. Well, if it's such a place where there are a lot of people, it's not that scary when it's dark, I guess. Well, yeah, I'm actually scared going outside when it's already dark. I prefer to be at home by the time it gets dark. Oh, is this like from Wolf and Spices? No. Yes. I remember reading uh, that manga. The background looks really cool. Yeah, I'm gonna forget it in one second. <laughs> I think he... Maybe his name means something? I think Mikado is also like a brand that makes Pocky. Like this kind of co cookies like sticks dipped in chocolate. I wonder what are these various reasons? Reselling? Ah. ah, it's best hand. Well, looks like he's very extroverted. You know, you can live in a big city and have like, no, and be cooped up in your flat, you know? <laughs> Holy shit, what are they going to do to her? Well, 
Looks like these are the dangerous people in the Kibukuru they were talking about. I wonder if it's going to become relevant. What? Illegal aliens? I'm sorry. So they're going to kidnap this girl to like, I don't know, sell her into slavery or what? So he's working with the kidnappers and she's uh, their target. He probably talked to her like for some other reason. I don't know, like selling her drugs, buying her time for something. I'm not sure, but also seems to be something shady. Because, like, the way he said, like, two people are waiting there already, and she went with him to a back alley, so probably, like, the initial reason... Hmm... Also was something shady. Is this guy... Like, a detective? <laughs> okay, yeah. Looks like the plot is pretty dark. Not a slice of life as I have presumed. Did I correct himself? I guess he got this job, but people are too scared of him, so they're not taking flyers. What? That was such a confusing line. It's a Russian. I find this all very confusing. He literally knows everyone here. <laughs> we were brought into a dangerous place. What the heck? 
Okay, so these are our kidnappers and they want kind of to sell her to someone, I guess. They're still like meeting with someone. And they say like there are missing p people. So they probably take like both men and women. Okay, so that's another character. I thought maybe that's like our main character in the future, so to say. It's not human. <laughs> This is interesting. This is a person on the bike. Now the question is, is it maybe someone who is going to rescue the girl? Yeah, looks like they are preparing to fight. No, they are prepared to kill people also. Using bike as a weapon, pretty cool. So the question is, is this the same no, this is a woman. It's not the same guy who stepped on the cigarette. It looks like Shocker didn't work. Oh my god! <laughs> is this something gruesome? Holy shit, that's a lot of blood! They are running away. So the person on the bike is a good person, probably... Oh, this shadow. Is this really not a human? Is there going to be something paranormal? Grim Reaper. Oh, that's like um, a headless, headless ride, a headless knight, this type of creature. I, I was reading a book by Mine Read, I think something about like a headless rider when I was little. So. The rumors are like completely true, holy shit. But I appreciate his um, bravery going on to some crazy shit like this with just his knife. That's pretty cool. But... <laughs> I guess without knowing Japanese, I can't really understand. 
how these names are weird or strange. But they, if they're cracking down on people in the like similar clothes, maybe gangs decided to kind of disguise themselves in other ways. That's peculiar. Either she has some injury, or she tried to commit suicide, or she is like the human allies of a headless person, right? <laughs> So she can take her head off. <laughs> oh, that's cute. So I guess people just see him from time to time. Hmm. Is this radar like this in Tokyo? I just wanna know. <laughs> Okay, let's see the ending. Also pretty dynamic song for an ending. I like the style of it. Yeah, so there are a lot of characters. This one looks so cool. It's the one that's tapped on the cigarette. I think I really like how he looks. And the headless rider also looked insanely cool. I felt like it was a woman, but maybe not. Uh, also, if it's someone who is... Uh, like a mythical creature could just have no gender at all <laughs> in theory so this is interesting i feel like this might be an anime where we see the lives of all these different people and kind of meet different people in tokyo and see different stuff so it's still kind of but also like with this a little bit of paranormal, which is pretty cool, to be honest. This story is a work of fiction. Okay, you you don't say. <laughs> that was very cool, honestly. I enjoyed the first episode a lot. Uh, seems like a show I'm going to like. I'm curious to see like in what direction it will go in terms of genre and in terms of story, uh, how it will like 
pick up or yeah like like a slice of life genre just will go through different like events and stories um casually so to say or it will be like some main plot uh that we are exploring uh, i'm it could go both ways as i said in the beginning i'm watching this like not knowing anything about this anime uh, but yeah from the first episode it seems exciting uh it seems also like a bit scary um in terms of making the reactions because i'm very bad at remembering names and sometimes i can be bad like with recognizing faces also like the hair and the clothes really help so I'm going to need to write down all of these names and I'm probably going to like forget and confuse some things, especially in the beginning. So um, please be patient <laughs> with me in terms of that. Oh, but yeah, thank you um, very much for requesting this anime. I'm enjoying it so far. Uh, so I'll watch and upload next episode soon. And uh, yeah, we'll see you. So Again, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed my reaction and share your thoughts if you have any, without spoilers, of course, in the comments down below. And see ya! Mm -hmm.